Thank you. Questions for Coach? Well, you guys started out pretty solid defensively, and then ironically, when Singleton, the best player, was out, when kind of things started going the other direction, what did you see shift there? Yeah, I thought, well, they, they knocked down some shots. I told our guys, you, you started the game so well defensively, and when we stray, uh, there was a, a patch there where we strayed, or a stretch where we strayed defensively from being really hard to score against, and at least making them earn, whether it was a breakdown in transition uh, or just a, a subtle out-of-position play, and that hurt us. And I look up, and they had 40, 45 points or whatever it was at the 14-and-a-half minute mark. We were down 16, and um, I said, this this can't be. And, it, and I was at least... I thought the guys rallied and showed some resiliency and, and getting tough defensively when they were hard to score against. And then we started making some baskets and making some plays. It's that old deal where, you know, guys got cold. We started missing some shots. There's certainly a lot of threes taken. Uh, when we got it in the lane, it usually came back out with a block. But uh, for a stretch there, I thought that that affected our defensive uh, alertness and in intensity. And... Um, and I thought some guys rallied and got it back, and I think we got it to 51-55. Um, but uh, they showed resiliency to get back into it, certainly with Chris out, caught a break. But, uh, um, you know, they it, it's hard. You look at them in the locker room and you say, you know, you're, you're fighting, you're getting close, and that can sound old. But I said, what's the alternative? I said, just don't go backwards. I want them to be the best they can be. And if that's scrapping in there and fighting, uh, you know, I said, at some point we're going to push through. Don't know if it's this year, don't know if it's next year, but but don't you dare go backwards, and that's what we're fighting. And um, it's a good defensive team we played, obviously. You, the last time the team was down, you know, 15 or whatever in the second half against Maryland, it did not show this kind of resilience. Are you curious when it got to 50 to 35 to see kind of how this was going to yeah, shake out? Uh, yeah, I, I just I, I didn't like the feeling of I thought we were too easy to score on. I, I, we were certainly cold from the outside. We didn't have... You know, we don't have a lot to, to go into, to go inside to. So, you know, we had a decision to make. And Florida State is susceptible to some scoring droughts, too. And, you know, that's where we said, hey, just, just, you know, you had the old, get, let's go possession by possession. We hit a three. Some guys made some plays. And then our defense did tighten up. Uh, I sure hope it's not because just because we made some shots. I know Moo was down. He had, a, you know, obviously a cold night. And, and um, we need probably our three of our four guys who are scoring to really be be at a decent level for us to, to be successful, what's especially the, in the road. What's the status of Will Cheryl? Yeah, that, that, that was tough because he, uh, in the Miami game, I, I don't know if he got kicked or the guy fell on it, but he re-injured his, his injury, the fibia that was fractured. So it's, you know, back to where it was in terms of when he's able to play, he can play. And the one thing that I was encouraged with with Will from a defensive standpoint against Miami, he was really moving against Clemson and against Miami. He was giving us that that uh, you know, veteran leadership and uh, positioning that would have helped us certainly defensively tonight when we were laboring. But uh, hopefully he'll be able to return soon. It's, it's just like it was, as I said before, when he's able to play, he'll play. Uh, when you say it was like it was before, it's back to where it was. No, it was I mean, it, the meaning when he's able to play, he'll be able to okay. play. That's gotcha. the. Cody, Sammy came back pretty quickly from the injury in December and then to kind of up and down. It seems like now he, he's moving well, or better at least, and playing a little bit more like he has. But when he came back, did he even tell you, even though he was healthy enough to play, it might take him a while to... Yeah, um, yeah he has, he's more lively. 